The Children of Odin, a retelling of the Eddis and Volsun saga by Pater Colum, with art done by Willy Pogani. Far away and long ago. Once, there was another sun and another moon. A different sun and a different moon from the ones we see now. Sol was the name of that sun, and Mani was the name of that moon. But always behind Sol and Mani, wolves went. A wolf behind each. The wolves caught on them at last, and they devoured Sol and Mani. And then the world was in darkness and cold. In those times, the gods lived. Odin and Thor, Hodr and Baldr, Tyr and Heimdall, Vidar and Vali, as well as Loki, the doer of good and the doer of evil. And the beautiful goddesses were living then. Frigga, Freya, Nana, Yuda, and Sif. But in the days when the sun and the moon were destroyed, the gods were destroyed too. All the gods except Baldur, who had died before that time. Vidyr and Vali, the sons of Odin, and Modi and Magni, the sons of Thor. At that time, too, there were men and women in the world. But before the sun and the moon were devoured, and before the gods were destroyed, terrible things happened in the world. Snow fell on the four corners of the earth, and kept falling for three seasons. Winds came and blew everything away, and the people of the world who had lived on in spite of the snow and the cold and the winds fought each other, brother killing brother, until all the people were destroyed. Also, there was another earth at that time, an earth green and beautiful. But the terrible winds that blew leveled down forests and hills and dwellings. Then fire uh, came and burnt the earth. There was darkness, for the sun and the moon were devoured. The gods had met their doom. And the time in which all these things happened was called Ragnarok, the twilight of the gods. Then a new sun and a new moon appeared and went traveling through the heavens. They were more lovely than Sol and Mani, and no wolves followed them in chase. The earth became green and beautiful again, and in a deep forest that the fire had not burnt, a woman and a man woke up. They had been hidden there by Odin, and left to sleep during Ragnarok, the twilight of the gods. Lif was uh, the woman's name, and Lif Rasa was the man's. They moved through the world, and their children and their children's children made people for the new earth. And of the gods uh, were left Vidar and Vali, the sons of Odin, and Modi and Magni, the sons of Thor. On the new earth, Vidar and Val found tablets that the older gods had written on and left there for them. Tablets telling of all that had happened before Ragnarok, the twilight of the gods. And the people who lived after Ragnarok, the twilight of the gods, were not troubled as the people in the older days were troubled, by the terrible beings who had brought destruction upon the world and upon men and women, and who, from the beginning, had waged way upon the gods.